San Antonio firefighters spent the night and part of the morning chasing fires all over an east side neighborhood. All of those fires were in vacant homes, starting with one just before 11 o'clock last night in the 1400 block of East Commerce. And then before 7 this morning, they put out three more in the 200 block of South Olive and the 900 block of Dawson and one in the 1000 block of Montana. Katrina Weber reports the fire chief does not believe all of this was a coincidence. Before you could hear the crackle and pop, you could see this fire from far away. But up close, it was clear firefighters were facing a losing battle. We were notified later, and therefore it was fully involved at the time we arrived. That was around 5 this morning. The fire in the 900 block of Dawson already had a head start. Okay, if you can stay out of collapse zone, go ahead and admit it to it. Because of the danger, firefighters had to back out and drown it from above. This was their third vacant house fire within about a one-mile area. The first broke out late last night in the 1400 block of East Commerce. A few hours later, another sparked up on South Olive. And before they could finish up on Dawson, a fourth vacant house was smoldering nearby on Montana. There were no people in there. There are no injuries to any civilians or firefighters. All four of these appear to be very suspicious in nature. The suspicions drew San Antonio's fire chief to the scene, promising to get to the bottom of things. I can't link them right now, but it is a pattern. It's concerning uh, because it's probably not a coincidence. It's been a busy night and early morning for these crews, but for arson investigators, the work is nowhere near over. They have to go through each one of these scenes thoroughly to try to figure out what happened. They say ultimately neighbors could help them solve this. Chief Hood is asking people to be watchful and say something if they see something unusual. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News.